One of my very favorite things about facial reflexology is that you can affect every part of your body through your face. And in today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can activate your lymphatic system. Your lymphatic system is your body's sewage system. Its job is to clean your body internally. It's taking out toxins and it's helping to fight bacteria and viruses and cancers and all of those things. When your lymph gets stuck and stagnant, it causes swelling and inflammation. Um, and a lot of people will have to have lymph nodes removed if they've had certain types of cancers or things like that. And that can cause lymphedema or swelling or things like that to um, occur in the body. When that happens, they have to be very careful about massage and different things like that. Um, however, the lymphatic drainage protocol on the face, you can do in any of these situations. Um, it activates the lymph through the reflex points and not directly on that area of the body. And so it's completely safe. We're gonna start with our magic wand using the sides of the magic wand, going up and down the side of the bridge of the nose and up to the brow. And this is activating your lymph within this armpit area in the front of the chest. You do have a lot of lymph nodes there and so we wanna get that area nice and moving. With each area that we work, we wanna do between 15 to 30 repetitions and we wanna use the same pressure up and down. Okay, now we're gonna work the other side Again, same thing, same pressure up and down, and that just helps to maintain blood pressure, not get your blood pressure too high or too low. Okay, again, this is working this area of the front of the chest and the armpit area, moving lymph through there. Next, we're gonna work up and down the nose, and this is working the whole lymphatics through the chest and the abdominal cavity. The abdominal cavity has its very own lymphatic system called the GALT, or the gut-assisted lymphatic tissue. And as we're working this, we're improving that lymph drainage through the gut and through the chest. This is a really important area because it does take the lymph has to um, mix with the blood in the um, superior vena cava in order for that lymph to get cleared from the body. Okay, next area we're gonna work is around the nostrils and this is working the lymph nodes of the groin. So with this one, I'm using the tip of the magic wand. Going back and forth. This is an area that a lot of people get a lot of hardness in. You can actually feel it on the face where it feels very hard and it might feel very tender in this area as well. If so, that's your body just telling you it needs some extra work, it needs some extra love and attention. This is a great protocol to do if you're gonna be sitting for long periods of time, if you're gonna be traveling, um, if you just wake up feeling swollen, you can do it up to four times a day. Also great if you're feeling yourself getting sick. Next move is to go up and down the smile lines. And this is activating the lymph through the legs to the knees. So you wanna bring this all the way down to the corner of the mouth. Working in there. Helping lymph move through the legs. So this is really great for varicose veins swelling of the legs, swelling behind the knees, which is very common that if you don't get a lot of movement that you get some lymph um, accumulation behind the knees. Other side, again, bringing it all the way down to that side of the lip. And then up above the top of the chin, and this is activating the lymph through the ankles and the feet. So if you tend to get uh, swollen feet, this is a great place to work. And then the very last move is working all around the ears. And this is activating the lymphatic drainage through the face and the neck. So starting at the top of the ears, coming down and around and backside of the ears. This is also activating your kidneys, which has to do with the water movement with throughout your body. So in addition to working the face and the neck, it's also just activating the entire movement of fluid throughout your body through the kidneys. Your kidneys um, filter the blood once the lymph has gone into it. It filters the blood, decides what fluid it wants to keep for the body to reuse and recycle and what it needs to get rid of. Okay. 
the other side. Again, we want to do about 15 to 30. And you can do this protocol up to four times a day. So if you tend to have a lot of swelling, if you have lymphedema or lipedema, or just get a lot of swelling in your feet and ankles, this is something that you can do several times a day, and I bet you will see some pretty quick improvement with it. As always, thank you for watching. If you need to order a magic wand, I will put the information in the description below. And um, please be sure to subscribe and like this video. I will see you in the next one.